Yo, what's up guys, welcome back next match, cross ban list cap, it has been a couple of days due to the new ban list, but we can finally uh, continue this one, subgroup G, first two decks, we have Drytron versus Prankets, Prankets, I think this is the first time it enters a cross ban list cap, so Adventure, Prankets, um, I think a YCS, yeah, YCS winning deck list uh, from 2022, so that's already post a ban list from the deck, if I'm not mistaken, with the uh, Meow Meow 2-1, um, but very powerful decklist. So which deck has the advantage? Um, there is not really that big of a difference in power level, I feel, between both these decks. I mean, both, both. if you look at the, the Tritron decklist as well, both have their unfair stuff. Uh, you know, Butler, double double Butler with the Meow in Graveyard, plus the Adventure package of one, once per turn negation is again kind of disgusting. While Drytron's on the other hand, OCG decklist, by the way, um, having access to, and this is cute, um, we already knew that Tritron was playing like stuff like Fenity's Ruler and or uh, Artifact Sight, which was searchable off of Ben 10, and uh, the cool gimmick of that, that's OG, <laughs> even though it's a couple of years ago, Helky uh, Firebrex into TG Wonder Magician to pop side, put your opponent under side, and then quick synchro for Baron. Um, so that's a very powerful play. So Drytron goes first, standard, but I need to uh, watch out for Nip. I do get Imperm though, and it's a problem, because now I cannot use the materials from my um, uh, Fafnir, right, for the Ritual Summon. So I try to make a big push. Maybe Beatrice was in the back of my mind, especially with Herald, uh, but I get nipped. So Maxi is still there, potentially letting me draw more hand traps. But um, let's see, so I called by the... Uh, okay, I, th I think I had to. This prevents the Gryphon from coming out. Yeah, 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 okay. And uh, with a Gryphon on field, the deck could maybe be able to go for game. You know, pump out many monsters. Uh, especially being under Gryphon or with Gryphon next to it for more protection. But there's Ash, there's Herald even. Like, Herald for Drytron is a super powerful hand trap. 3 off for this particular deck. Um... So yeah, this uh, no hand traps here this time for Adventurer, and this should be a game. This should be game, right? Getting the, uh, another search off of Heralds, and this is basically full Drytron combo. Alpha, Zeta, uh, Gamma eventually search with Bent and search Eva. This is also a decklist with Eva legal. And of course with Herald in hand, you have uh, another extension, or at least another hand trap, ready for a potential nip, if it's there. Uh, but I should be able to go for game, right? No, like, hmm, am I? Aren't I? Aren't I? Am I, am I not able to go for game? Hmm, okay. Yeah, Link Karibo for a bit more damage. Uh, okay, that's fine. Okay, I can go for Zeus. Um, Helki, oh, okay, yeah, Helki combo for, um, yeah, Wonder Magician into sight. Prevent my opponent from using the extra deck and go for quick uh, Synchro Baron as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, oh, the Ash prevents the Eva from uh, searching. So this is GG. The fact that this deck has access to Sight, it can kind of disgusting, even though it could be a brick. Okay, so Adventure Prankets goes first, and no hand traps, so that's a problem. Um, doesn't really seem too strong of a hand, especially with Zeta, the Ritual Spell Searcher. You know, getting rid of Benten is okay-ish. The Herald is not the best going, I mean, in the opening hands. Uh, Lightning Storm could come in clutch. Problem is... Um, uh, Griffin is there as well, yeah. I do have Callby though, but Callby doesn't really solve that much. So it doesn't really seem to... Uh, <laughs> looking too good. Callby could be okay against Pranket's Meow, but there is still the one of Butler White, so that, that's a problem. Uh, yeah, even though, let me think, um, Tritron did side deck multiple evenly matched as well, so evenly matched would, would be disgusting, but sadly not the case. So Callby on, um, what is it, the dog that gets back, what is it, two? But uh, that's getting negated, so the Lightning Storm comes in clutch really, really hard. Get rid of all the spells and traps, but uh, Double Butler is there and all the prank gets stag out. So disgusting. And here another evenly matched, ah, but even then my hand is kind of ah, mm, nah, mediocre. Like my place after that, well, maybe, because again the one prank it meow is gone. Um, so if you're able to port wipe the field, Hmm, there might have been plays possible, but not the case. I lose Eva, and I think I already used up my normal summon, so that's game next turn. Okay, so game number three, go, uh, go first, and this is definitely an okay, uh, full fuel opening hand. Problem again is a potential nip, so we, we already have Herald. Uh, so let's see, am I able to pump out another Angel or Fairy in hand? I do, but the problem is I need to use Ben then. You could, should, could, maybe Nibiru here, problem is it's a weak Nibiru. 
Um, and yeah, Nib is getting dropped now on the ritual. Okay, that kind of could make sense. Imagine Nib going through that could fizzle my uh, ritual spell as well. Uh, but again, Herald, Herald saves the day again, as we've seen before. I mean, that's why it's there for Drytron. Um, so Union Carrier could potentially tutor Eva for more searches. Am I able to search? Mm. Okay, so no side lock. The thing is that, yeah, the uh, Helki could be important to touch or get rid of the field spell or the um, Adventurer continuous spell. So Helki is still fine for TG Wonder Magician. Uh, I get Dropleted though, so that's why the TG Wonder Magician definitely helps out getting rid of the field spell because the field spell is able to chain lock the, um, what is it, the prank gets summons, right? And already it at the ash and, you know, the chain lock could have been super important, but nope, TG Wonder Magician definitely takes care of that. So Destiny Hero Phoenix Enforcer hits the field, but um, I mean that is fine. I still I was still able to keep Droplet and with Herald, I can search any ritual and this turns on the entire uh, Dry Trump package. So this should be my duel. Uh, sure, you could use your uh, Phoenix Enforcer, but it's not really going to accomplish anything. Uh, let me see. So another search. Uh, if Phoenix Enforcer is going to use this effect, I still have Droplet. Go for a big uh, Fafnir. Send what is it, Gamma? And this is cool. Contact Fusion for Anthus, and then uh, you know, Synchro for Baron. Um, pop the Phoenix Enforcer, I think, and negate the effects. Something like that. Yeah, something like that. Um, <laughs> and Emma, the question now is am I able to go for a game? I should be, right? No, sh I, I think I should. Uh, I think the deck is access to Borrow Savage. Herald hits the field, get rid of Prank, it's Meow. No, this is enough. Yeah, 3k of a barrel, Mubeta, Fafnir, 2k from the Tritron, and then Herald as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, kind of disgusting. Really, really disgusting. Okay, so going second. And this is a, an okay opening end. Droll, Droll is strong. Uh, especially with Herald as well to block any of the prankets. Uh, so the Droll, I guess, prevents the Griffin. And I guess maybe should should have respected the, um, the Droll. I mean, you could... What is it? You can target, right? Or not add to the hand, but equip. And then still search uh, for uh, Griffin, and then I would have used Troll, and then you can drop Griffin and go from there maybe. Hmm, I think so, yeah. But then you need to sacrifice a card in hand. Oh, okay. But th the thing now here is is that again still no evenly matched. Imagine you know being able to punish the token there because you know <laughs> the only card that they're allowed to keep after evenly is the token. Uh, so Zeus kind of wrecks the entire deck. Again, the fact that the deck had only ac access to uh, one prank, it's Meow, hurts the deck here. I imagine another Meow, you could normal summon the Water One and then, you know, go for full combo. But uh, not the case. And this should be my duel. Again, full combo. Uh, Gamma for two, should be dropping Fafnir as well. There it is. Send, is it Delta? Delta for an extra draw. Uh, normal summon Herald first for... Um, Again, another ritual, I think my last one, the Tritron ritual. And uh, this should be more than enough. Union Carrier for the extra tank boost. Ben 10 for Beatrice, yeah, sending Eve, Eva. Yeah, for another surge, double surge, yips. Uh, so more negations, getting back the Herald, and then I should be dropping the uh, Herald. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, equip for the lols for the uh, extra tank boost. And this is indeed more than enough to take for a game. So Tritron wins this one, but... Uh, like, in all honesty, like, looking at both hand traps, and especially at stuff like Heralds, uh, I think Drytron had a slight advantage. But, uh, um, mm, yeah, strong one. Okay, next one. This is a big one. We have Tirlament versus Snake Eyes, and it's going to be the Ishizu build for Tirlament. So, let's see. It's a powerful necklace, but we'll see how this one plays out. Against pure Snake Eyes. Uh, Christian Ure uh, Urena, yeah, yeah, his list from uh, the past wise, yes. Okay. Guys, this is it. Thanks for watching. Feel free to leave a card or like if you enjoyed the video. Leave me a sign out. Peace.